They came in their hundreds, driven by grief and anger over the death of Jasmine Pretorius. The four-year-old's body was found under a bed in her father's flat on Sunday. She is suspected to have been raped and strangled. The man accused of her death is a close family member. The 23-year-old accused appeared disorientated and confused when he appeared in court. He had blood on his shirt and numerous facial injuries. Asked by the magistrate how he had been injured, he responded, I fell. When the suspect was driven out in a police convoy, the full extent of the community's rage became apparent. Police responded with pepper spray. Pepper spray doesn't work. And this woman's foot was broken. But the protesters were undeterred, responding with renewed rage when Jasmine's father and granny walked out of court. They blamed the pair for leaving Jasmine with her alleged killer. Police say neither of them are suspects in this case and the community's anger is misdirected. They don't know the real story. Everybody is telling a different story. And, uh, but I can tell you the father is, is innocent. He's got nothing to do with it. Jasmine is expected to be laid to rest later this week. Karen Morn, Johannesburg. Know more about your world. ENCA.com